What is up everyone and welcome to another one of these Mac Pro videos. The last one uh, was called uh, Possible Dead GPU in my Mac Pro or something along those lines. Um, but we have since found out why the Mac Pro GPU is not working properly and that is because of the security update. The security update changes the build number of the OS which breaks the Nvidia drivers. Now this sounds simple enough, it's like okay well cool, reinstall the Nvidia drivers or change your build number or whatever, but I have no video and I don't have an original card. So to all of those that still have an original card, it's very easy because they just literally boot up with the original card, change a couple of files, bang and they're done. Uh, me, I'm trying to do it without any video, so it's kind of impossible. Um, but yeah, at the moment it's going okay. Um, actually, I say that I haven't done anything. I'm currently, I'm currently along the lines of even though it's going to take longer, I'm in the mind to use my time machine drive to restore the Mac. I think that'll be a really, really good idea. Um, so at the moment, I'm booting from a Mountain Lion DVD um, that came in this lovely pink case. I'm using a Mountain Lion DVD because it's the newest DVD I have. Uh, for Mavericks, I just installed it um, as is from the App Store or whatever. And same with Yosemite. Um, but it's something that I'm going to change soon. This has taught me quite a few things, guys. But we'll talk about that in a minute. Um, so yeah, I'm trying to boot up from the Mountain Lion CD. I can't get it to boot up, boot up from it at the moment. I can't really tell what it's doing because I have no video. It's a very tricky scenario. But one thing I will do is someone suggested that uh, to use a VGA display um, while doing all of this. Someone in the last video commented saying use a VGA display because it'll be the easiest for the card to output and to do all of uh, its bits and bobs you know when I'm trying to troubleshoot things. So anything right now, anything that I can do is is, um, is a good thing really and whether that makes a difference or not. I'm running DVI at the moment. Um, a lot of people think my KVM switch is broken. It's not. I was running through the KVM switch with the MacBook Pro and everything was fine. It's actually the security update, as I've already described. So yeah, this is doing nothing at the moment, so I'm going to pause the camera and see what I can do. So I've connected the other display up via VGA, really roughly for now. Uh, all the cabling's a bit crappy and everything, but yeah, it's there. So if the Mac feels like displaying anything on VGA, then it will. So that's good. Um, I've tried to restart to boot from the disk again see what happens. Um, just kind of really hope it does to be honest because this would be the easiest thing to do, restore from the latest time machine. And lo and behold it spat the disc out so we'll have to try and clean the disc or something I guess. So guys life is not going well. I've uh, had to completely take the optical drive cage thing out because I managed to get a leopard CD stuck in there. It wasn't booting from my mountain lion CD so I thought there's no harm putting a leopard CD in there. Lo and behold the damn thing got stuck. It wouldn't even uh, open with holding down the mouse button or anything like that, so I just get this big clump of dust out of the way, half of which I've just dropped on the floor. Brilliant. This is actually going horrendously, guys. Um, as you can tell, the GT640 is out of the machine. I actually have the uh, 54, whatever the hell it is, 50, uh, what is it, 5450 installed, and yeah, it's doing its thing, uh, which is a whole lot of nothing, obviously, because this is going dreadfully. So, that is that. Uh, let's close that. And, oh, guys, I really don't know what to do, really. Um, I really don't know what to do. I might have to get a Mac compatible graphics card. Uh, my biggest advice to everyone that owned a Mac Pro was, yeah, sling a 600 series card in your system. It's great, you know. Um, it's a really good way to do it. You know, 680 in the Mac Pro is, is proper good and everything. But, Christ, this is more of a Hackintosh issue, issue than anything else. Um, you know, but I guess if you use PC parts in your Mac, you are you do have elements of hackintoshing then. Uh, but anyway, I'm talking crap, so I'm going to put this back together. So everyone, after another 45 minutes of frustrating troubleshooting, we still have nothing. Uh, I've uh, followed a couple of guides, done this and that. Now, the fact that I do not have an original GPU um, kind of sets me apart from everyone else that's having this issue. Everyone else seems to be unslotting their graphics card, slotting in a Mac graphics card, uh, executing a couple of commands or updating the driver because there's been an update since all this went down. Change the cards out, boom, you're back in business. But I don't have any display and there's no way of me getting any display. Now for some reason, what I don't understand is I performed fresh installs of um, Mountain Lion 
with this graphics card, I believe, or I may not have. Let me think. Let me think. Yes, I believe I did. Um, or not. No, I already had Mountain Lion installed in my X1900 XT. Yeah, scratch that, guys. Basically, um, it's about time I got my hands on a Mac, on a Mac original graphics card. Um, so, I've just been clearing out some of the dust and that from the system. It's really, really not nice. Um, but yeah, I'm going to get my hands on a Mac original graphics card. And um, I think I know a couple of people that can help me out with that. So, this is the scenario. I've got a couple of people telling me to use my Mac Mini to render videos. Um, yeah, that would be insanely slow, guys. The MacBook Pro is about 10 times as fast when it comes to that kind of thing. Um, but I'm not using my Mac Pro still, so this is the update. You should be seeing this video Monday. It's a Sunday as of recording, and it's a Sunday, so I just can't be asked to deal with this anymore, guys. Um, it's kind of stressing me out and annoying me. Um, and also, booting into single user mode with no video is all cool and that, and just execute the commands and hope that you don't make any mistakes when typing them in and hope for the best is all well and good. Um, but I'm not comfortable doing that because I'm not comfortable in single user mode anyway, and it's all I always go through stuff with a fine tooth comb when I actually use it. So having no display and trying to enter commands, especially considering I'm not the best at copying from one source to another, you know, I kind of mess stuff up a little bit and that, and I, I bleh, yeah, I'm, I'm really not going to do that. I want a display to uh, sort this out. So, one thing I've learned from this, guys, is um, even though we haven't solved this, and you're going to see this video still unsolved, uh, this situation is still unsolved in this video, sorry. One thing I have learned is if the system is working fine, and I'm going to do this with my Hackintosh, I'm going to create clone hard drives in order to preserve the images that work fine. And that's something that I'm going to think about quite a lot over the next few days and weeks. Um, so that I know exactly where I am in terms of disks and whatnot. Because this is very important. Um, having downtime on my setup is kind of inconvenient at this moment in time. Because of the whole YouTube scenario. Um, and also a few other reasons, you know. This is just not not convenient at all. Um, but anyway, guys, I'm sick of ranting and rambling now, and huge thank you for all of your suggestions. I feel very comfortable knowing that I now know what's wrong. When I made the first part of this video, I had no idea what was wrong, um, because I hadn't heard of anyone having problems with a security update, and then those threads started popping up on Mac rumors and stuff, and a couple of people linked me to them, and now I feel a lot more comfortable because it's not just me. Um, again, though, there is no effective way out there to sort this out without your GPU. Um, it's a non-EFI card, so I don't get anything. I don't get a boot menu, I don't get a grey Apple logo, I don't get anything like that. The only time my card springs into action is when you land on the Mac desktop. Um, so before, I always used to say to people, look, you know, I've given people a lot of advice. I'll be like, yeah, I've run a PC card in my back for a couple of years now. It's been running great, you know, no hiccups, and you get much more performance for the money. Um, but there's no kind of win-win situation because... I guess the win-win situation is keep a PC, uh, have a PC card, use it all the time, uh, and also keep a Mac card handy, I guess. Um, but yeah, even like something like a GT120 or something totally crap like that is uh, is still <laughs> fetching ridiculous money on eBay. But anyway, I know a couple of people that may be able to help me out. So I'll be messaging them after this video. But yeah, that's it for me rambling, guys. Um, huge thank you for all your help, and it's you guys that helped me troubleshoot this, because I wouldn't have looked for those again on Google, those links. So that was brilliant to see the threads, and uh, great to know that it's not only me having this problem, like I said. So, massive thank you for watching, everyone. I hope you've all enjoyed the update. Um, yeah, editing will continue on the MacBook Pro. I don't know if you'll be seeing the next part of this tomorrow. I kind of doubt it. You'll probably be seeing the next part either Wednesday or Thursday, but this definitely has put a bit of a delay on my scenario. And also, because I've been stressing about this, the, my room is still upside down from when I sorted out my desk setup. So as you can see, my desk setup is all sorted. Well, it's kind of a bit messed up now. Um, but I still have the room kind of messed up, and I've been been—I've had a couple of gigs, so I've had to get some lights out and that. So I'm very stressed, guys. I'm, I'm not having a good day at all. So hopefully we can get back on top of things. I feel kind of better after ranting. Um, you know, I really do. And after I get a couple of videos made, I'll feel better then. But yeah, 
Look out for an update in the next few days, guys. And uh, as always, keep firing your suggestions if you want to suggest them. And uh, I've tried all sorts of video cards now, all sorts of everything. It's just not happening. So it's time to put this to bed. And uh, well, for now, until I can get my hands on a Mac graphics card. Anyway, um, before I rant on any longer, cheers for watching, guys. And I will see you in tomorrow's video.